But now we have Ice Snacks versus the amazing Utopian Ray. And honestly, who is Utopian Ray using in this match? Oh, Palutena it is. Palutena and... Wait. No. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Yep. And honestly, here we are, washing machine galore, near and near into up air. Just slightly missing that up air. However, great parry on that on the Rob attack, but right now gains some nares in a little bit of forward air, gain that good spacing away from the Rob because we already know that Rob has a great range with his gyro and his lasers as well. But however, uh, looks like Ice Tank is getting a little bit of a hard time trying to recover. Oh, you know what? I love when I talk and then the opposite happens. It always happens to commentary. <laughs> it's commentators. It's the commentator's curse. It really and is. And honestly, when it comes to New York right now, these are two characters that always had a forefront when it mm -hmm. came to the scene. Especially right now, being Rob, you have to know how to go against Rob. There's like... The Robs are like rising up right now, and the Palutinas are dying down. Mm -hmm. This is the only, the only, only other Palutina I actually know about besides, of course, Jen, who frequents the venue, of course, with his own Palutina. But I'm really glad to see some more Palutinas in the in the scene. But I'm, I, I, Rob, I'm sick of you. I'm sorry. You're so yeah. big. You take up so much space. You must be dethroned at some point. However, there's not to say that Rob isn't not a, a bad character. He's just like. Oh, played so well, wow. but right now getting that back throw kill from uh, from Utopian Ray, taking off Ice Axe's first stock. But right now Utopian Ray needs to be careful not to lose it because Rob has some serious crazy combos. Wow, and oh, the moment ooh. you say that, and honestly, I'm quite genuinely surprised that um, that Rob Spinney Rotorarm, I yeah. believe is the name, I believe so. Um, didn't exactly take the stock, but you know, Utopian Ray maining or using Rob himself also knows how to avoid these certain moves. Oh, it was that excellent DI from uh, uh, Utopian Ray, yeah. however, getting that up air out of, uh, off of Utopian Ray's first stock as well. However, Rob at, at Ice Knight's at 71%, Utopian Ray just at starting at 0% against, it's 0.8%. And honestly, I don't know if you saw, but Ice Knight's really waited to go for that um, killing move after doing a down. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Trying to get those, not those Palutena and Nair loops as you know as all Palutena's can do. Oh, okay, gain that up smash. Trying to get the back here, but not exactly. Mm -hmm. Not yet. Oh, the reflect. I never see Palutena use to reflect against uh, like you know Robs or any projectile characters. I yeah, wonder why. It seemed like in this case, Ray didn't want um, Ice Knights to break the momentum mm -hmm. that they already had. And honestly, there you go, up air into up air. Yeah, definitely. Um, even though that Ray is only at like 50-60%, Rob can take the stock like in an oh, no. instant. They know exactly what to do to take oh, wow. the stock. That was a great perfectly timed side because Rob Tappy does have a little bit of delay in the very first few frames. So being able to time that with uh, Utopia Ray's recovery and gain that good amount of percentage on him is great on uh, on Ice Max's part. Uh huh. And honestly, really good play on Utopian Ray and knowing the character matchup because the moment that they were thrown off stage with that uh, F throw, they went immediately for that reflect because knowing that um, the gyro went thrown will immediately hit them at that angle. Agreed. And right now, both players trying to take a little bit of center control. Uh, Ice Knight has to be very careful with 112%. And Utopia Ray still with a stock lead, getting that reflect. Ooh. Ooh, you know, like even though Ice Knight is like at such a high percentage, they're playing this like. They're playing so well. They're playing like not super nervous. Ooh. And you know what? If I go into Palu and they haven't used their um, <laughs> F-Tilt throughout the whole game and then they Agreed. suddenly fill it out, I'd be a little confused too. I have a feeling that he didn't really time it quite correctly because he did wait a little bit, but, mm -hmm. I, but the F-Tilt does come out for a, a quite a long time. And neutral getting up when instead of like maybe rolling would have been a better option for, uh, for Ice Knacks or they're discussing like stage and stuff. Y'all know that the tablet's right there. The tablet's not... The tablet's... The they're so funny. There's so many monitors they're going so on. Funny. Like, I'll, like, take a step back and, like... There's only five here. There's... Only five. Yeah, there's only five. There's yeah, only no five. big deal. They have, like, two. It's fine. Oh, we don't have the... Stop stage battle. Oh, we don't see what stages they decided to ban. Yeah, we, we can't see the stage ban. That's okay. I'm, I'm gonna take a wild guess. They're it's gonna PS2. Go PS2. It's PS2. But they're gonna run it back. Oh! oh small battlefield, my bad. The other well, stage. Well, PS2, but running. not PS2 yet. Yeah. It's, it's basically PS2 with like, you know, cute little colors. Yeah, and like, more songs. And more, and way more songs, please. But right now, it's being made getting a clean 67% off of Ice Snacks with a few of those Paul pa uh loops that we all know and hate. And getting a supposed to flame over on him. 
getting a good amount of distance away from the Robin, taking great control of center stage. But right now, Ice Knights might be able to bring it back with all those de Rob down tilts and forward airs. Ooh. But right now, yeah, ooh. Can, can we just talk about how Utopian Raid just racked up 113 in like 20 seconds in this game? I'm telling you, it's those, it's those Palu Noob, those Palu Nera loops. It's the noobs. Mm -hmm, it's the, I hate that noobs. It's those noobs. <laughs> and, and it's that explosive you flame. You know what? As we were talking, we completely, um, Discredited Ice Snacks and his amazing classic Rob setup of um, throwing the gyro down and then waiting for the normal getup and then catching it with an up smash. And but right now, look at this. They both went right, right back in neutral, kind of about the, about the same amount percentage. Yeah, of this was player. The, the first stock, but mm -hmm. played over again. It really is. Oh my god. They just keep getting a little bit percent on each other. And <laughs> Ice Knight just barely missing those down tilts, but getting them right again on the ledge. Grabbing maybe a forward throw into a laser reflected back at him, though. Yeah, like, Ray definitely knows what Ice Knight is going for. I mean, as a raw player himself, he knows what he'd go for, too. And is now being incredibly careful, not trying to go for um, n n roll ins. <laughs> Yeah, agreed. And but I want to say that, you know, great on, on Ice Knight for trying to read that jump up from the ledge on Utopian Ray. But Utopian Ray was able to just simply avoid that because those platforms that we see on Small Battlefield are going to be amazing wow. for Rob. And wow, getting that down, uh, that down air off the stage, taking out Utopian Ray's second stock. But right now, Ice Knight still has to be careful. Even though he has a stock lead, he is at 104%. Yeah, and honestly, Ice Knight's playing in this game is completely different than the Ice Knight's that got, like, caught up in almost everything that Ray had planned out in the first stock and within the last game as well. Now getting the gyro in their hands, they're gonna Oh, trying to the gyro up in the air, I see that. Oh, oh but trying the, to aim ooh. it, I see. That was a little cute. Yeah, but Robin you know. And, that's the Robin and coming exactly, out. Exactly, and honestly, you see that um, I start shaking his head when he got that, uh, when he got back thrown. It's just such a move that you want to avoid when you're at such high percentage, and it's almost a guaranteed kill if Right now, getting those dash tags in, getting those nair loops in. Oh, but just barely getting, not getting that forward air and just, and uh, getting uh, punished by um by Ice Knox's own forward air. Ooh, it's just a back and forth, these two characters trying exactly. to get their own combos in. Yeah, but they're not, they're both like interrupting each other and oh, they're oh. not, oh, there it is. It's flying, it's flying. He said goodbye. Down tilt back here, Palutena, you know the vibes. Oh, we see a little bit of gas coming out of Ice Knox. Um, that fuel might be running out too, oh, and there you go, explosive, explosive flame taking the flame. shot. Yep. Completely unexpected, really. I know that he was way focused on that on gain that gyro mm -hmm. out. And uh Utopian Ray was able to just be like, oh watch this. You, you, explosive flame and just absolutely demolish uh Ice Knight's last stock and taking that game for himself. Yeah, and honestly, explosive flames is one of those moves where you're like, Oh, I'm not gonna get hit by it. That's a move I'll never get hit by. But then it just comes out of nowhere when you're not expecting it, and then you get you lose by it. Yeah, it's a it's a really good move for Palutena. It's just a like you don't there's no um it's, it's like a teleportation kind of like move where you, there's no like you know how it's like fireballs and shit like that mm -hmm. and things like that so it never <laughs> not bad <laughs> but like there's no tail or anything that shows like where it's going so it just it appears out of nowhere just like that and it's gonna take your stock because you're not paying attention to things exactly, like that exactly exactly i wouldn't pay attention I, to me that. too i was like when did that come out <laughs> Boom. There it is. Kaboom. Straight up. Kaboom. Boom. Bing bang. Oops. Bing bang. Bing there bong. we go. That's it. That's it. Bing, what did you say? Bing bang? <laughs> I was going to say what like, is that? No, no, like, you know, like zip zap zop, but like bim bam. I'm sorry. Wait. <laughs>